Hey guys, Ian here. Welcome back to my Steve vlog. Today I'm with Emma Parts, your heart's take on St Johnson at a ground where they have not won in eight years. Christoph Bear retains his space in the team from the Rangers game. Hopefully he can last the full game and hopefully we can finally get a win here for the first time since 2010. Can we do it? Let's find out. Won the hearts. Number 15, Jason Kerr. Five minutes into the game here at Madurma Park and Hearts lead 1-0 thanks to Arnold Jim Header. Love this stuff. Half time here at my dinner part. St Johnston won, Hearts 2. But a bit shaky at times in this first half. We got the lead thanks to two set piece goals from Oli Bosnich and Arnold Jum. Two great headers, by the way. Speaking of Jum, he's my man of the match for the first half. Played very well and overall deserved his goal. Now, it's need to sort out the back. Deacon Lawrence going, getting dragged over to the right far too many times. So hopefully, Levine addresses that at half time. Come back out the second half and get these three points wrapped up. On the Hearts, let's get it done. Satisfactory performance in the first half, but could do better. So it's the morning after the night before. I still don't know how that's a penalty. A draw that should have probably been a win to be honest if the referee hadn't had other ideas and gifted St Johnson an equaliser for absolutely nothing. The two goals at Hearts were pretty well taken. Two set pieces, two headers from Oli Bosnich and Arnold Jim. It's good to see Jim back scoring goals after that header against Rangers that looked certain for the back of the net. Got cleared off the line at the last minute and obviously the one against the winning got disallowed so it's three games and he's finally scored the header at the third time of asking. Oli Bosnich also scored another goal, loved the celebration by the way, pointing to the badge. Clearly loves the club and it's good to see that he enjoys scoring goals for the famous. So, we roll on Saturday, Motherwell at home, big game, must win game. And hopefully we can get back on track, although it won't be easy. As we saw last night, they snatched a late goal to steal a point off Celtic at Fur Park. So it'll be a tricky test for the men in Maroon. But hopefully we can rally the troops and get together for a very important game. And hopefully come away with three points. Thanks for watching today's match day vlog. If you did enjoy it, please leave a like and a comment. Tell me what you thought. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on post notifications so you never miss a single video. That's it from me. See you for more very soon.